Kenshi Critiques, number Kenshi Dick Grad's favorite anime. Welcome to another la double live reaction to Shita no Joe Season 2, Episode 21 and Episode 22. Let's get into this. And this will be a long time, but I have a order, order and a rhythm with which I do my live reactions. So you'll always see Gankutsu, Shita no Joe, GTO, Gankutsu, Shita no GTO. Then somewhere in the middle, I might throw in a Moa Gundam Origin or a one off thing, right? That, that comes up as in, you know, something that arises, right? Uh, in that order, so Blade Runner I did, I did uh, uh, Mobile Suit Gundam Origin, and you know maybe in in the future there might be a pilot episode I check out, right? Some base. So you know Yashiki's coming next season. I might check out the first episode of that. I might check out Magus Bride, Magus Bride, something, some something, something, Magus Bride. I forgot what it's called, but that that sort of thing. But just because I check it out doesn't necessarily mean I continue it. But sorry about the the long delay. I've just been very busy, very tired other things to do want to do other things not not just because i want to be slave to, to this kind of things my hobby right but you don't want to be up at your hobby's ass right you don't want to do something for the sake of something like gaming for the sake of gaming right like that kind of thing so uh let's get into this ramble along enough is she no joe season 2 episode 21 come on got the music got the lyrics here Thanks to the guy who gave me the proper lyrics, the condensed ones. ひかってないてないおらの命も和ずかなこの瞬でにかけを仕掛けられた花火見たように魔界にのやがってゆく分かってないてないいまのおれにはこどくぬこのにおいおいがえだぶちあたえてくだけるなめにはやさしなどいみがいがないのさでれっ you done an amazing job. It's time to stop. Yeah, middle. Fuck, wait, the wait shit is the toughest thing, man. Nah, Joe. Oh, 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 oh. Bantam weight pops. To him, that's like defeat. <laughs> it's about people for him. It's not even about the sport for him. It's about the people. The people he gets to dance with. Even if meant putting his life on the line. He can't do any less than that. Still, man, the shadow of fucking Rikishi on him. He can't get out from under, man. What are you gonna do? <laughs> yep. I remember that. That was my thumb, man. Throw that fucking water down. <laughs> Joe. That's why comedy does like uh, parodies of this, right? They do see the the cheese factor in in the show that old, right? But Joe, man. This show is very bleak, you know, for a very uh, spirited character MC who could exist in the animes that exist today. The show is so, uh, like, bleak in its tone, right? That tone my editors and producers might have issue with. In today's day and age. Producers be like, nah, we can't have a uh, MC that dies. We can't have an MC that fucking is constantly getting beaten up. We need the MC to have progression. That big spot up. I can hear Rikishi singing. Fuck, you know, man. He's gonna go nuts, man. Seriously. 
I can see him losing his mind, man. Drive a man mad. I'm growing on Nishi's voice now. He couldn't have that go oafish voice for, for this season, especially in dramatic scenes. It's a while ago, but I still remember. <laughs> I remember this. <laughs> Tough love, yeah? <laughs> I was looking for the look on his face. So sad, isn't it? He wants everyone to succeed, man. People he loves. This, the the way they live in, right? It makes sense why boxing is like the be all end all, and why they've got they can afford to waste all this time stressing over boxing. Cause look at where they live in, man. The boxing is their way out, way out of the the heads, way out the the way of life, way out of everything, man. So this is why you can kind of cohesive this show is. They're the only ones that will support him in this. Get, oh my god, in the same basement that Rikishi is. Oh my god. Yoko's gonna facilitate that. That basement room. Oh, 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 oh shit. Following the footsteps. Hey, do you know what? He's walking in Rikishi's footsteps, which means he's walking to, towards death potentially. But is Joe different? Has Joe got the edge that he needs to? Not go down the same road fully. Which way is tomorrow, man? Joe. There's no getting out of that, man. Once some guy's in there, man. Rikisha to the grave. There, the look. That look in the eyes, you remember? When Rikishi was sitting there like a ghost. Will Joe go down the same road? <laughs> he checked to do a karate kick. You're a boxer, fam. You rather you were. Oh my god, man. For such a manly anime, Dump It cries a lot, man. That's heart for you. That's true heart. Never let that happen. Hammer. Yoko was a frail woman, right? He, she couldn't get Rikishi out, right? Even physically. But Dompe can go, like, drag his ass up. I've actually known for a while. He was expecting Joe to tell him. You know, Dumpy used to coach boxers before. I really want to see the bo boxers he coached before. How some of them, how their lives went down, right? Under his tutelage and stuff. It would be interesting to see. A prequel. Because right at the beginning, this guy was a washed up guy, right? They did briefly show... Uh, tidbits of his past, right? Flashbacks to the people he coached and he brought them to ruin and all that. So please, Pops. Just let me be. He's got such a unique voice, man. When you listen carefully to it, such a unique voice. Sickly ass back home. Don't please, I don't want anyone bothering me. This is for your own good, man. You're too. You're too. Your weight class is low enough. And fucking hunger striking like fucking Gandhi and this shit. Oh man, no, no, no. Nah, see? He's so weak right now, he can take him out. This is how he's gonna be in the ring. He's gonna remind him. Okay, oh, sickly man. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Good opportunity to show him, innit? Starving yourself won't get you anywhere. Nice. There. You need your fucking strength. You need to eat. Come on, Dumpy. Shit. Look at the wet shoulders. Right now he's still got it, but trust me, a couple of days of this. He's become like Rikishi. He's, he's just lost it. I know why he wants to do it. I, we understand. We understand, right? Joe and I alone. Dumpe is gonna pull out the big guns in six days. Shit. Hellish part of fasting. This isn't even fasting where he eats sometimes. It's like full on starvation. No longer enjoy the pain. And I'm the only one. And he wants to be there for him when he does. Shit, they need someone on guard, man. Look at that dedication. Dump it, man. Bit more of a dad to him than his own dad. I'll bear witness to your hell, man. You know what? When Dump it was not lying in the beginning. When Dump it said he was willing to give up everything to train him, right? He fucking meant it. And he's lived up to that. Well, they have the set of the cognac and shit. That quality in them. Persistence, man. Shit, man. Even he, he that moment of weakness. Holy shit. That was so, so, that was when you knew he death on him. That's when you knew death was coming from. Ah, man. That is so dark. Like, legit, one of the darkest scenes I've ever seen in fucking anime was this, man. Everyone can relate. Oh, my God. Fuck, can they recreate that scene? It looks as horrific as ever. Man, why make us relive this scene? Warm water. He won't want to drink it quickly, right? I could fucking drown if you fucking just got galloping down cold water. Warm water, you do, you want to drink in moderation. Plus, you get cramps in it with cold water as well. Just like the help for Look at that cry, man. He was so full of life. He didn't drink. And that was the death fucking. That was the. Death flag. What's wrong? It's, it, surely it's not that bad. Surely it's not that bad. When you got a weight problem is when you can't fucking drink water. Like a real bad problem losing that weight. You're seriously you're seriously slipping in the Kit Kats on the side somewhere. If you if this is the ex extreme you have to go to. There's something wrong somewhere else if you're having to do extreme shit on the side. Like not drink the fucking water. 90% your body's water. Put a 
fine fight. Yes, yes. And he was, man. Look how great he was, even in a weakened state. In his, in his fucking full-on state, he would have knocked out Yabuki in the first couple of rounds. Good night. Oh, you're yes, so Look at that, man. They reanimated this. There's more expression. I wasn't talking about the fragility of life over fucking cigars and cognac, man. There's something about them, man. They just, they're not quite there. They're privileged. They're from privilege. They don't understand. They think they understand, but they still don't understand. Whoa, there we go. There we go. There we go. The thirst. The thirst. Even for fucking Blade, the thirst hit. No matter how many asthma inhaler pumps fucking Blade had. The thirst always gets you, man. Do you remember? Play 3 with uh, Jennifer Beale and uh, Ryan Reynolds. Give him, throw him in the hay like. <laughs> they fucking alright again, man. It's finally begun. It will break him. It will break him. Get your center, man. He thinks that's the best time to box, and you got that thirst. Keep your mind off it. Keep your mind on your mind, your money on your mind. <laughs> Let's go. Dump it, man. What a fucking soldier. Oh my god, that's the fight, real fight. In his head. Those eyes, man. He's going down that road. I just hope he don't die, man. You want to emulate your heroes, right? But there's always parts of your heroes' fucking lives, right? That's just destructive. And this is that destructive part. What is he doing? He's trying to make it even harder so he can't be bothered to break the door down. Oh my god. Joe. Dump him, man. Why are you putting your boy through this? You saw what happened to Rikishi. And a punch, a fucking punch from him. Yeah, he he, he could can't pull a Yoko, going to strike himself. The worries cause the appetite. Fucking hell, eat, dumbass. Keep your strength up so you can keep your strength up for Joe. She thinks her food's cooking is gonna end up fixing that. Nope. Three days. Force freedom. I know that's cruel, but you, sometimes you gotta. It's like people who go on strike in prison, American prisons. People say it's inhumane to force freedom. I'd say it's more inhumane to let them die. Don't be a fucking ma like Gandhi ma. I've achieved nothing. Let's play Manco cards. I thought that he died, this little kid. <laughs> Some sumo to Joe, man. They're missing Joe. Ah. Oh. <laughs> oh man. Kids, man. Heard the boxing in my ear. <laughs> nice. Look at those eyes, man. It better not be a quick... I know what he's putting himself through will make him shredded, right? But I hope... It's not a quick match, man. Let me sweat flying all over the place.
Oh my god. Everything has limits, even for fucking Rikishi. Only death awaits. Rather stand anyway. He don't believe him. He knows what he's putting him, putting these guys to. Come on, let's go back. To Fucking hell, man! How many times are you gonna make him say that? There he moved. Does that is that all that gets him? The steel beams moved out of the way. Oh, he did. He's, he's coming out. Look, oh my, oh my god, fucking hell. She sees the same death looming on him, the same with Kishi. Symptoms already shown. All this effort for Yongbi, and Yongbi is what? He's not even the end goal that like fucking Joe needs. My, my man's looking shit putting himself to oh my god looks like death isn't it he better he does all this shit in the fresh air in some fucking dark room somewhere man you need people around you to keep your spirit up Rikishi with loneliness it was just him and death fucking in that room See, he has people with him. He's not doing it alone. He wants to push him till he fall. Oh my god! Just a little more. One kilogram in a day. Fucking hell, their spirit is eyes lit up there. He needs. Don't swallow the cotton. Shit, man. Did you not forget fucking Takamura, man? This is extreme. <laughs> All that Tiger Moore stuff was taken from this, man. It's a 5 kg weight. A little heavier. Oh my god, man. Save his life. Is he gonna what convince him that he's he's reached the weight? Shit, look at the tricks he's having to do, man. Da -da, da -da. Sometimes you gotta do this. He's done doing it out of love, man. No fame, nothing is worth the price of fucking his life, man. Joe's life. I I agree with Dumpy, man. I agree with Dumpy. Look, I ain't no, I ain't in that position, man. I ain't in that position like Joe, right? To be a boxer and wanting something so bad like that, right? I'm not in that position where I have to do put that with as well. But I fucking understand Dumpy, man. It's love in it, like at the end of the day, man. Dumpy's not wrong. That's one thing we need to fucking get clear, right? Dumpy's not wrong. 
Dunk, Dump is just as invested in fucking success as Joe is. I love that. I love that. I love that part of the song. Everyone's got that favorite part of that song when a beat drops or some violin kicks in or flute kicks in. That's what it is, man. It is what it is. <laughs> Fucking great music. Men are the best singers, man. I don't give a fuck. Men are the best chefs, men are the best singers. Old time singers as well. They got they got that. You feel the fucking ages in their song, right? You feel the fucking ages. Song of the ages, man. You feel their past, their nostalgia, man. Men made this made this well what it is, man. We keep the wheels turning. For good or bad, we keep the wheels turning. Ashita no Joe season two, episode twenty-two. Come on. I'm not going to sing again. I'll close that word document I in. See if I can remember bits of it. Probably won't. This weird though. The pacing changes. Mia gere ba hoshi o yoni. I only know that line properly. He got the night tonight. Oh, I know. He no chimo. No, no, no. Mitayoni greatest. <laughs> My boy Joe. Gotta play day trick sometimes. <laughs> lap dog. <laughs> She's a lap dog, man. Convince him he's got the weight, man. Don't make it like you're not losing enough weight so you push to the limits really quickly. Well, that's dangerous. And then the morning of the weigh-in. Oh, shit. Maybe they're trying to trick their official weigh-in. I think no matter what happens to Joe, Kim will learn, man, something from Joe. That he doesn't know about his fighting spirit, man. Human computer. I love the how they what the, the quick turnaround for the fights. Oh, man's got form. Pitiful. Come on, man. You've seen what Joe's done. It's not pitiful, his fucking record. Wow, oh, it's all about the weight. But Joe's got natural talent, man. I find him just stand one of them through the window. That looks like death, man. His lips are fucking you know. up.
What's up, bee? What's up, like a fucking mosquito, man? It's just a fucking porn or some shit. Wait, it's altered. One kilogram heavier, someone will notice that. I mean, visually, no, but holding it. Imagine he finds out. <laughs> oh. That's a great way of standing a bike up. Bikes don't use that enough. There are bikes that use it, but not fucking modern bikes. Bicycle do <laughs> Are you being pops? He's pretending like he's giving him what he wants, but he's got it all planned out, man. Du -du 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 -du. That mitt work. Oh god. That's too much anyway, man, for any man. gonna be painful just looking at it. there we are Fifty five point two seven. Less than two kg, shit. But it's gonna be embarrassing at the way it. Poor guy, do you know what? It's cool to do it, but it's for his own good. I don't know what he'll. What can be forgiven, right? Letting a guy slip into. Death, right? Uh, Joe wouldn't mind that. Joe's prepared to die in the ring. But it's the people that are left, right? The people that love him, right? This is like fucking, like, you know, assisted suicide thing. The moral debate about it. It's assisted suicide. It's just, well, it ain't a life to take, man. If you can preserve life, it's better. You know, he should have tried to fix the weight at the official weight. They won't let the tampering happen though. The embarrassment though for all that shit that he put himself through. I can see it man. I can see him feeling bad for him. Manifest Joey Wookiee. You know, Wookiee Jew. More lies on me man. If Joe just focused on training right now, he'll naturally just lose it anyway, rather than the weight loss. Just train a bit more for three days, you'll lose it. He naturally lost a kg in a day, he can do it. If he... He's feeling, he's looking better. What will give it away though? If Joe finds out, how what will give it away? Weighing. <laughs> the guy's brushing his teeth outside his ass. I love this guy, man. They will show this guy. And they got up. <laughs> I hope Nishi don't fucking give it away.
Did he didn't remove the weight, did he? He didn't remove the weight, did he? It better still be there, man. It better still be there, man, that weight. Wow, you're looking good, man. He feels good. Joe is handsome again. You got tea. You've always been a looker. Wow, look at the charmer, yeah? These guys are... <laughs> yeah, Buki. The guy took off some more weights though. Getting there is what's hard. God, this is going to be embarrassing. What's going to happen? You can't keep trying for the weigh-in, right? You gotta meet that deadline. Mama. <laughs> Mama picked them all up. Together. Either. Oh man, he's so hyped. There needs to be, everyone needs to be on this man, for his sake. Oh man, this is gonna be not not cringe in a bad way, cringe in a good way. This is gonna be just Oh man, so embarrassing this is gonna be. So so embarrassing. This is the other side of things man. You're gonna embarrass him. God damn it. He's going to be 0.5 over or some shit, man. More than that, even. Oh, please, God, help him. Why does he look like that when fucking... He's under 118 fucking the other guys. and he, Bodies ain't used to shit. Look at that. He's seen what he's done. Bloody... Oh, God. Oh my god, don't embarrass him, please. 900 grams. Still! He can get rid of it quickly. This is gonna be like, it's fucking tough. Shit. Oh man. <laughs> he was 118 before the car trip. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. That's kind of funny, though. Jim Scale. I was ready for this, man. Fuck. You bastard. <laughs> oh, 
god. Nishi, man. Look how fucking sad Nishi looks. Oh my god. Please, man. Don't do this, man. You should have tampered with the Fisher scale. He's only 900 over. He, a couple hours. Oh my god, don't do this, man. Don't do this, man. Don't do this. Don't. Oh. Shit. Don't, don't do this, man. Don't do this. Oh my god. Stop him, someone, you fucking idiots. He did it for love, man. You bastard. Fucking just chill out, fam, man. Chill out. You need someone big like Nishi to keep him in line. Look at that. The bear hug. No, no. Man. He did it for you, man. Fuck the passion for the boxing. Wow, even he's uh, the blood. Oh my god, the sight of blood. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, the sight of blood. <laughs> what? What the fuck? Oh my god, the sight of blood got. Fucking, this is weakness. Blood's his weakness. Fucking Joe was throwing up. Punching people. This guy sees blood. He's... Invisible blood off his hands. They're both similar. Like, they're both trying to redeem themselves for something. Now he's gonna ask. No title match. Glove weights. Yoko will make it. Oh, nice. Simple. 9 or 10 before the final way and shit. I knew it. He can do it, man. He lost, lost the KG properly. Take a shit, man. Take a biggest shit you ever taken. Nice. It's not much. But it takes. Da, da, da. Oh my god, what? Don't give him another punch, man. What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. This is so intense, man. Cuts his flesh off. Ah, Joe, manage it, man. Joe, manage it. Take a biggest dump you ever taken. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what these guys do. Suck on a mushroom or something. He's gonna be crawling to the fucking 2 p.m. way. Don't be staring at water, fam. He looks suicidal there as well. <laughs> Ha 
heard of a Japanese boxer? Is he gonna shave everything? All his teeth fall down. It's not gonna hurt. But don't pull your teeth out, huh? I don't even have spit left. And the line. I don't know. Pharmacy. Laxatives. He's gonna take laxatives. He's dehydrated as it is. This will destroy him. Alright, so I fucking looked at a pharmacy. Suicidal. Powerful laxative. Oh my god. Our biggest dump of his life. Just bring him the scale, man. Put him out of his misery. Look at the desperation. Oh my god, look how scared they are. Two hundred grams more. Cut your shave your hair off then. Two hundred grams left to lose. Shave your hair, man. What kind of box has hair like that anyway? Bloody hell, man. Internal medicine, x ray psychiatry. Go to a bar, but like do something, something else. Blood. 200 grams worth of blood. It's not how it works. Oh my god, man. Please, doctor. Fuck. This is too much. He's going to collapse. Tonight's. Alright, fuck it. Get some fluids in here. Oh my god. This guy, man. He's getting... He's getting... He's, he's dead. He's dead. What the fuck, man? Oh my god. What is he doing, man? I give a shit about this guy character. I've been with this guy for fucking... 70 fucking episodes. 60 something episodes, man. What the fuck, man? Ah, oh, man. The shit Joe puts us through, man. Me and Dumpe, man. And Nishi. And fucking Yoko. And every, every other motherfucker this time. <laughs> yeah,
that greatness are uh, people. Thank you guys for watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, follow me on Twitter for Lizard Rage something. That is a fucking. This fucking. You know, some, some words just don't need to be said, right? The reaction shows you enough, right, how I respond to it. And then you can compare to how I responded to animes you've seen before, like Monster LOTGH. You know that the way I've been responding to Joe, you know it's fucking up there in the top five, man. You know it's fucking up there in the top fucking five, yo. Thank you guys for watching. Be sure to subscribe, yada, yada, yada. You know, you know all the shit I say. Peace out, guys.